In 2021, the World Bank Group celebrates its 30 years of partnership with Mongolia. Over the past three decades, Mongolia has made significant progress on its development and people's well-being, but challenges remain. The Mongolian economy has expanded significantly, with GDP per capita rising more than fourfold to over $4,000. Mongolia has become a lower middle income country, but growth has been volatile. The reliance on the mineral wealth has increased. Economic diversification remains critical to generate productive jobs, especially for the young. People's living standards have improved substantially, but growth has not generated shared prosperity for all. Mongolian citizens expect better quality education and health services, and a cleaner and safer living environment. The COVID-19 pandemic has taken a heavy toll on Mongolia. It also led to losses of jobs and household income, and further increased the vulnerability of the poor and underprivileged. At this critical juncture, the World Bank Group has prepared its new country partnership framework to guide its engagement in Mongolia for the next five years, from 2021 to 2025. The strategy is anchored in Mongolia's national development strategy, the Vision 2050, and the government's program and the World Bank Group's twin goals of eradicating poverty and boosting shared prosperity. It has been developed in consultation with government, development partners, civil society, and other stakeholders in Mongolia. The strategy has three focus areas. First, strengthening economic governance. Under this pillar, the support focuses on strengthening fiscal management and institution to attain macroeconomic stability through sound economic policy making, addressing vulnerabilities in the financial sector to improve its stability and governance, and improving the efficiency and effectiveness of public resources for better public service delivery, particularly in the rural area. Second, boosting competitiveness. It means improving the business environment to attract investment and promoting better access to finance, especially for SME. It means more sustainable infrastructure investments in transport, energy, and digital services to improve the country's connectivity. At the same time, the World Bank Group will continue to work on sustainable and high-quality mining investment while putting a strong focus on supporting non-mining sectors with potential for higher productivity and job creation, especially for youth and women. These include agriculture and livestock sector, digital economy, tourism, and other sectors. Third, improving quality of life. This includes work to enhance healthcare services, particularly in response to COVID-19 pandemic. It also focuses on efforts to improve quality of education and strengthen the social protection system by making it more targeted at the poor and more fiscally sustainable. Finally, it envisages investments to improve air quality, heating services, urban transportation, and other municipal services to improve livability of urban centers in Mongolia. Embedded in all of our efforts are two cross-cutting themes to create more and better jobs for Mongolians, especially the youth and women, and to improve climate resilience for future generations. Putting together, this is a plan to support Mongolia to overcome the COVID-19 crisis and work towards a more resilient, inclusive, and sustainable future.